reindeer. I have my ears in that I got from Target and I thought they were super cute. And I have my Christmas pillow that indicates that it is only 24 days away from Christmas for me right now and I'm so excited. I decided to do a Roomspiration video which is basically where I do a whole bunch of easy DIYs on my channel and I'm also going to teach you guys how to do some two very simple treats because some of you guys have been recommending for me to do a cooking video which I will try to do more in the future but this is just a quick little treat so you guys can show your friends or your family or if anybody's coming around or you're just in the Christmas spirit then hopefully you guys will find some inspiration in these ideas that I have. I hope you guys have a happy holidays and let's just get started. To get my room into the holiday spirit I decided to change up my comforters and just switch it on to the stretch side which has burgundy and green tones to it and I also changed up my pillowcases. Throw pillows are an absolute must have for me so I have this Santa one that changes accordingly to the days and I also have a pillow that says naughty and nice on it and I thought it tied in really cool with the bedding. And I also throw on this burgundy blanket. Decorations is a great way to get into the holiday spirit, so I found these Santa cards that are so cute from Michaels. To secure them in place, I just put a few strips of tape so it makes it easier to take them down later. Another great way to decorate your room is by doing the classic Christmas tree. So I have my Christmas tree out and I'm just spreading out the branches so it looks more natural. casually wearing my reindeer ears. I like to turn on my tree lights just before I start adding the balls on the tree. So I got these tree decorations from Pier 1 Imports. My finished tree will be available in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Woo, that's my finished tree. So one of my favorite things from the winter time in general is just really cute snowflakes and snowmen. So I decided to make some easy DIY holiday treats including those two. So to make these adorbs little reindeer, you're going to need some pretzels, some skittles, marshmallows, some chocolate frosting, and six chocolate covered donuts. First thing you want to do is pick up a piece of candy and a bit of chocolate frosting and place it upside down so the S is on the bottom side and those will act as noses for our little reindeer. Your ears. I'm just going to take these mini pretzels and cut them in half. After I'm done cutting all the ears, I'm just going to place these into the donuts and try to make them straight so they look even when you're done with both of them. Melikalikimaka is a thing to say on a bright Hawaiian Christmas day. At this point you can leave them alone but I decided to get some marshmallows and I just cut them into little pieces and put a bit of chocolate frosting to look like pupils and I just put a little bit of chocolate frosting on the back so they look like eyeballs. As you can see these are super quick and easy to make. Say Merry Christmas to you. And this was my finished product. I thought these are super cute and I will definitely be making these. So the next DIY are these snowmen that I thought were really cute as well. To make these you're going to need some chocolate frosting, some candy corn, a tray filled with parchment paper, and I'm just lining up the white powdered donuts onto the tray. Then I'm just going to scoop some chocolate frosting into a Ziploc bag and cut one of the tips off so I can pipe on the eyes and the smile. I'm going to repeat this step to all of these snowmen. Finally, I'm going to take a piece of candy corn and stick it in so it looks like a little nose. Leave me a comment down below telling me which one we thought was cuter, the reindeer or the snowman. So I hope that you guys all enjoyed this video. If you did, then don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you're new around here. And if you want me to do any more of these Christmas-inspired videos, then you could just leave me a couple comments down below telling me what I should do next. 
And don't forget to give this video a big old thumbs up. All my social media will be linked in the down bar below. And I'll see you guys next week. Bye.